Thank you, everyone. Uh, so my name is Olushe Olubenle, Deputy Director uh, here in the Department of Public Works and Transportation. It's been a very busy week. Uh, we're in our second snow event, uh, in our second 12-hour uh, shift, and it's really exciting to have uh, the County Executive, County Executive Angela also Brooks here with us. Uh, so we just want to thank you, uh, and we want to welcome you uh, back uh, to DPWNT uh, Command Center. So I'm going to hand it over to the County Executive to say a few remarks. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, um, first of all, to Deputy Director Ola Binley, thank you so much um, for your leadership. And to everyone else, I want to set the record straight. I'm not here tonight. Uh, she said, thank me. I, there's nothing to thank me for. I'm here to thank all of you uh, for the absolutely amazing job that you have done. We have not had a lot of snow over the last few years. Um, so an event like this one means a lot um, to all of our citizens and residents who want to look out and make sure um, that their taxpayer dollars are put to good use. This is the moment where it's tested. You know, we pay all of these taxes, pay very high taxes. And when it uh, when the services are needed, we have been proud to be able to deliver those services in a really, really impressive way. And it is due in no small part um, to all of the hard work that all of you have put in. We know you've been here since Wednesday as a part of, of this operation. These 12 hour shifts is not easy, um, but it is because you all have been prepared you didn't just start this on Wednesday is what we understand in order to do it as well as you did. It means that you all had to be well prepared mm -hmm. uh, in advance of Wednesday. So I just wanted to come by and say thank you to every single person involved in this operation uh, for your hard work and your commitment. Um, it does mean so much that our residents can safely travel on the roads, that they can feel that they go uh, where they need to, to get to work and to get to the other critical places they need to go to. We know that, well, hopefully that we won't have much more than this. <laughs> One of the things I've learned as county executive is so funny. There was a time where I would celebrate when I heard that we were anticipating snow. Uh, I was like everyone else. I was so happy. And then I realized we couldn't afford for it to snow. <laughs> so now when they um, announce snow, I grab my chest and say, but we, but you know, but we can't afford it. You know, <laughs> it, it's that we can't afford it, but you all make it, um, you know, really do make it easy for, for all of us. So I, again, you know, to team Prince George's County, you have come through yet again and have made us all very proud. So I came out, I wanted to brew a lot of coffee for you tonight. That's the reason I'm a little late. All this coffee I had to brew. I had to bake the donuts, <laughs> make sure I boxed them up and brought them over for all of you all. But again, um, really, really, really on behalf of so many mm -hmm. uh, Prince Georgians, I know the news media even went on um, to compliment the tremendous job you did. And again, that's not easy to have happen either, but it's not gone unnoticed um, by everyone who remarked on how amazing the job was that you did. So thank you so much again. Uh, I think I'm going to be putting out a message to those who are out on the roads. I enjoy, I've done that before in the past uh, and I'm, I'm going to do that tonight as well. So thank you again, everybody. I appreciate thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.